but it was an extreme effort upon uh, maintenance, mission support group, and operations to come up with a plan to get all our jets moved off base. Uh, they spent the summer in Topeka, and uh, that was a, a lot of effort to continue flying, operating, continuing doing the mission four hours south of here. We've continued training air crew members. Maintenance has done an incredible job uh, keeping the aircraft uh, ready to fly. The runway was supposed to open up uh, at the beginning of October, but you know, weather and delays happened and we flexed with that. Uh, the Sioux City Airport Authority has been great to work with, uh, flexing the plan. We were able to get a few jets back uh, early in November so we could uh, do some exercises with them. But as of today, we'll have uh, six of our eight airplanes back. Uh, we have got a couple down for maintenance. Uh, but it's not going to stop. We'll have, uh, we're flying over the Thanksgiving holiday doing the uh, flyover for the Iowa-Nebraska game the day after Thanksgiving. Uh, we'll come right back from Thanksgiving and we got an aircraft generation exercise that will be a week long. We're gonna... It's just great to have airplanes back. Uh, this is our home. This is where we want to be flying out of. feel a lot of pride when we see the airplanes overhead and when we're uh, flying out of Sioux City here. So we've missed it. I've missed uh, sitting at my house and being able to see the KC-135 uh, fly over. And I'm really looking forward to seeing them in the skies again here in Sioux City.